How to disable Google One Tap Sign Up Prompts? I've recently begun seeing common pop-ups on sites on which I do not have an account. The pop-ups prompt me with my real name and Google sign-in email, which is being provided either by being signed into Google slash Gmail or being signed into the desktop Chrome browser. Sign into example.com with Google. Your name. Email at example.com. Continue as name. To create your account, Google will share your name, email address, and profile picture with example.com. By continuing, you agree to example.com's privacy policy and terms of service. The functionality providing this seems to be variously called Google One Tap, Google YOLO, you only log in once, the Google YOLO API for Open YOLO, Google One Tap sign up and automatic sign in, Google account sign in prompts, sign in with Google, log in with Google, join with Google, use your Google account to sign in too, no more passwords to remember. Signing in is fast, simple and secure. One tap sign up and automatic sign in. This URL. You can provide seamless authentication flows to your users with Google's one tap sign up and automatic sign in APIs. With one tap sign up, users are prompted to create an account with a dialog that's in line with your page's content, so they're never taken out of context by a sign up page. With just one tap, they get a secure, token based, passwordless account with your service, protected by their Google account. And, of course, since there's such little sign up friction, users are much more likely to register. I frequently see the pop-up, obscuring the content, when I follow a link to medium.com. It is also being added to other random websites across the internet. Large websites using this sign-in method include Sign into medium.com with Google Sign into nytimes.com with Google Sign into eBay with Google Sign into Quora with Google Sign into Trulia.com with Google Sign into TripAdvisor with Google Use Pinterest with Google Use hipmonk.com with Google. Create a Wayfair.com account with Google. Use your Google account to sign into Reddit. Vimeo, log in with Google. I don't object in principle to using my Google account to sign up for a service, but I do not want these pop-ups obscuring the site contents on page load. This pop-up feels like a notification from Chrome, prompting me to use my signed in Chrome account. It appears to be something I should be able to disable, like Chrome notifications, in my local copy of my web browser software. Or, if not a Chrome browser notification, it also feels like something I should be able to disable from my Google account settings. How do I disable these pop-ups and ensure they are not shown on any website? Settings type changes preferred over content blockers, if possible. You can disable these prompts from your Google Accounts permissions page. This URL. Or go into your Google Account settings and to the security tab. Here you will find a section signing into other sites. Select the signing in with Google link to get to your permissions site. Google account sign in prompts. Allow Google to offer a faster way to sign in with your Google account on supported third party sites. Toggle off Google account sign in prompts to disable these prompts across the web. 
Don't be fooled by the toggle since it currently doesn't seem to display the toggle state correctly. Click it once and refresh. In your ad blocker, block all content from smartlock.google.com. That will be the end of these pop-ups. This pop-up is provided by a Google service website owners can select to integrate on their websites. Understand one tap user experience. This URL. Google now tells us exactly how to opt out of one tap alerts. Globally opt out. Users can opt out one tap by disabling the Google account signing prompts flag in the connected apps page. The opted out sessions aren't shown in one tap. If all Google sessions are opted out, one tap won't display. They also detail the specifics of when you will see the next one tap pop up after closing one on the same website. Exponential cooldown. If a user closes one tap by tapping the X button in the header, for a time period, one tap won't display for the same website and in the same browser. The following exponential time periods are used for cooldown. The cooldown status will be reset after a successful one tap sign in. Daniel's answer works on medium.com, and probably others, but not in Pinterest. That site keeps nagging you on every visit, and uses pop-up elements containing multiple random image strings, so you can't just filter on these. The substring to filter on for blocking the pop-up with adblock plus seems to be. Note that medium.com prompts you only once anyway, your non-response is kept in a cookie. Thank <laughs> you.